The fall for Chick-fil-A continues. Let's get into it, guys. Welcome to the Conservative Truth. Please like, share, subscribe here to the channel. Hit the bell, guys. Enable notifications so you never miss new video content. And support me on Patreon, patreon.com slash conservative truth. Link in the description. Sign up. Become a $5 patron today. We have a $5 tier set up there. Of course, you could donate even more than that if you would like to. And a special thank you to Nim, who just up their Patreon pledge to $20 a month. Thank you so much for that, Nim. I really appreciate that. Also, Mark Orsted and Melissa for becoming $5 patrons. All the censorship going on with YouTube, guys, I could be kicked off this platform at any time. So all the content might be moving exclusively over to Patreon. So don't wait for me to disappear off of YouTube. Go over to Patreon right now and sign up. I would really appreciate it. Now, what is going on with Chick-fil-A? I've been covering this ever since the big announcement on November 18th, they were dropping the Salvation Army and the Fellowship of Christian Athletes after donating to them for years. All of a sudden, they're changing their direction. They want to start donating to smaller charities. And one of those charities is Covenant House, which is they're a charity organization that helps you know homeless youth, but they advocate strongly for the LGBT community. In fact, so strong that they hosted a drag queen story event in New York not too long ago. So just know that this is the new partner of Chick-fil-A. Chick-fil-A is essentially endorsing Drag Queen Story Hour. Through their new donations, they're gonna be making to Covenant House. This was a company that once stood on the biblical foundations of marriage between a man and a woman, and look what has happened since then. Not only that, but also, it was recently discovered that back even in 2017, so you think this just recently happened, it didn't. Back in 2017, they made a $2,500 donation to the Christian hate group, the Southern Poverty Law Center. Okay, this is a group that goes out and targets Christians, often enacting violence upon them, designating them as hate groups. This is what Chick-fil-A has now become. Can, can you can you imagine, you know, Chick-fil-A hosting a drag queen story hour at one of their restaurants? I, I mean, this is just sick what's happened with this company. And you know what, CEO Dan Cathy, you have to answer to God for this because what you're doing to this company, you had all the support in the world. Everybody was on your side. No matter all the backlash that was coming your way, it didn't matter. I think God was blessing you, but now look what you've done. You've taken that all away. You've sold your soul to the rainbow people. And now I don't see any way out of this. Guys, let me know your thoughts in the comment section. Thank you so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. Again, check me out on Patreon, patreon.com slash conservative truth. I'll be back with more. You guys take care. Please be safe out there. God bless each and every single one of you, and I will talk with you soon.